G. Welcome back to my channel. So, so excited that you are here. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. I appreciate you. It is Jody Dunn, and I am coming at you with my rebate haul for this week. Super duper excited. Um, if you're new and you just found the channel, I am so happy that you are here. Would you please say hello to me and let me know that you are new right down there? I would love to welcome you to the channel and say hello back to you. And if you are already subscribed, thank you so much for coming back to another video. I truly appreciate you. I would love to hear, did you get a weekend warrior? Um, and if so, what was it? So real time, it's Wednesday. I am pre-filming this video because on Thursday, I get to go spend the entire day babysitting my EJ. I am so, so excited. I'll pop a cute picture up on the screen. I didn't know they're all cute of him. Um, Grayson and uh, Edward have something to do and she has asked me to babysit. So me and the girls are going to be there all day. So at this point, I don't even know if I got a weekend warrior. <laughs> so what I'm going to be bringing you today is... Um, I wanted to complete, on my husband's Ibotta, he got the um, Klein bonus, $5 for 21 offers. Um, I've already completed that on mine. And he also got a $5 for 18 offers midweek moneymaker. So I'm going to be completing that in this haul. Um, I did a, a fair amount of it through the... Um, the drug stores. I, if you watch my videos throughout the week, you already know I snag some rebates over at the Walgreens and things like that. So we should be able to knock this one out. I think I need maybe like 13 or something to hit both of them. Um, and then of course that will unlock the peak bonus for him and all of that good stuff. I am going to be going over to the Kroger. We got some more money maker alcohol over at the Kroger. I freaking love it. Uh, so yeah, that's what we're going to be doing today. So I think all of these rebates, except for maybe the ones that I did at the drugstore that I've already filmed and, and you guys have already seen those videos. If you watched those, um, those are the only rebates that were coming up to expiration quick, like the hot, hot rebates that go fast. So I think all of these rebates are going to still be valid. So again, I would love to hear if you got a weekend warrior bonus. I'm excited to see if I did. And if it's um, something that I want to do, then I'll probably just complete it on Friday. And of course, if you snagged any awesome rebates, I'll love it when you guys share those down in the comments. So we're going to head into Walmart and then go over to Kroger. If you enjoy the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you so much. Let's go snag some awesome rebates. Here we are in the Walmart. And the first thing I'm going to do, because this deal just keeps on getting better, is on the Twix. It's 98 cents for this package of deliciousness. Shopkick raised the rebate. It's 550 buy kicks and 25 scan kicks. And yes, this product scans just fine. That's $2.30 back from Shopkick. It's going to make this free plus a $1.32 moneymaker. All right, repeat deal. It's easy and I got coupons on the Campfo Fanique. It's priced at $3.97 in my store. This is like the antiseptic bandage thing. I don't know. Anyways, I'm grabbing this. And I have a paper coupon for $1.50 off. You can always search coupontom.com to find out what insert any coupon comes from. So that'll bring me down to $2.47. I have two rebates attaching for $1.60 total. So that's going to make my final cost $0.87 cents for this. Thank you so much to Coupon Wins with Lynn's. I saw this on her channel. She saw it over on Sister Saving You Cents, two channels that I love. Um, on this pink suave, I think she said it has to be the conditioner. I didn't even check the shampoos. Uh, but it's priced at $4.97 in my store. I've got these two rebates attaching. Uh, so that'll bring my cost down to $0.97. Cents. Another repeat that I did last week. I'm going to do it again on the clean and clear. Uh, the face wash is priced at $4.40. So I'm going to go ahead and grab that. I have printable coupons that I printed. Went right through my Swagbucks link. Sent me right over to coupons.com so I get paid to print and paid to redeem for $1.50 off. 
So I'll pay $2.90 at the register for this. And I have two rebates attaching to this, one for $2 and one for $0.10 cent any face wash. That'll bring me down to just $0.80 cents for this clean and clear. Another super duper easy rebate and something I would purchase anyways is gonna be on the cat food. Cause I got two cats at home, so I need to feed them, right? <laughs> I'm just gonna grab this little can of Friskies for 54 cents and you guessed it. I got two rebates attaching to this one as well. 10 cents each on both. That's gonna bring me down to 34 cents. Another repeat on the mentholatum. It's priced at $1.97. And yes, I actually have two rebates attaching of this one too. Thank you for it's a day of double rebates, but it's the same rebate that is attaching the any rebate that is attaching to the Campho. So we're just gonna call this one a one rebate for 75 cents back. I keep on searching for the new finish. I don't know, we've had this rebate on Ibotta for a month and my store has been sold out. If you can find these in your store, not Ibotta, Swagbox. For $7.57 each, there is a rebate back on Swagbox for $20, but my store's been sold out. I'm in the candy aisle. I'm going for the Nerd Gummy Clusters. Because you know I love these things. Grayson was over the other day for Father's Day and she was eating my Nerd Gummy Clusters. So I need to get another box. And yes, I'm only grabbing one box because I will eat them. So they are 98 cents. We have a 50 cent rebate, except for huge gasp. Uh, this is why you always gotta scan products in the store. My husband's Ibotta does not have this rebate. I don't know how that's possible. I'm still grabbing it because my Ibotta has this rebate, but I'm not doing this Ibotta haul on my Ibotta. So I need to grab one more thing since he doesn't have this rebate. Oh my gosh. Uh, I'm gonna go for the wheat yogurt because Donna loves it. So we're gonna pick up a strawberry. It's $1.34 and Ibotta has a rebate for 40 cents back. All right, since everything except for one of my rebates had double rebates because of all these any offers, this is all I'm gonna be grabbing from Walmart today. Of course, I will be doing a pay with Ibotta, which counts as a rebate. There is a link in the description box with full tutorials on how to use all of the rebate apps. And it is on the playlist section of my channel as well. The last video in there is an Ibotta haul where I walk you through exactly how to do a pay with Ibotta if you are unsure, but it makes reaching your bonuses that much easier. And I just roll my rebate money. So it is super fantastic. And if you're not using any one of the rebate apps and you would like to, my referral codes are all listed in the description box for you as well. So now what we are going to do is we are gonna head over to the Kroger and do an awesome moneymaker deal on some alcohol and then snag a couple more rebates. All right, so here we are in the Kroger and I'm looking at the Bud Light Seltzers. I'm gonna try the out of office pack this time. All my Bud Light rebates reset on the Kroger cash back. These are priced at $13.99 this week. I think that's the sale price. So three of these are gonna cost me about $42. I have eight Kroger cash back rebates that are attaching to this, giving me back $70 in Kroger cash back rebates. Oh my goodness. It doesn't even stop there. Um, you need to download the BYBE app. I did this last time I did the Bud Light Seltzer deal. There is a rebate for $3 back on each. It is a limit of eight times. You can see mine already says that I've already done it three times because I already got back $9 the last time I did it. So another $9 coming back from BYBE. But wait, it gets better. I scanned these on Ibotta. They are showing that there is actually two rebates attaching to them, but there's no, they're not listed under any store. My friend Steph told me that she just went ahead and filed a ticket with Ibotta and said, hey, I bought these. There's rebates on Ibotta, but they're not showing at any stores. Is there anything you can do? 
They have given her back the credit several times. So I'll be filing a ticket with Ibotta for $9 back in the form of Ibotta rebates. After tax, it's going to make these Bud Light seltzers about a $43 money maker. All right, next up, while we're at Kroger, uh, in our inserts this week, there was an awesome advertisement. Uh, it was in the save insert. If you don't get the save, you wouldn't have seen it. Um, for free snuggle product, a try me free where you submit for a rebate up to $10.99 back. So I'm looking for the most expensive product that I will use and that I want. I really wanted to find like a big thing of the scent shakers, but either my store doesn't have them or they're sold out. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and grab these Snuggle. Um, they're like scent shakers, booster things that you put into the wash. They're $8.99. Oops, dollars dollars And this is what the rebate looks like. I will leave the link in the description box for you in case you did not see it in the inserts or in case you don't get the save inserts. And I did have a little issue submitting this, so make sure you stick around to the debrief and I will tell you how I kind of had to finagle around that and then I changed my mind. So I'm putting these back because I love the Snuggle dryer sheets and I found one that's priced at $9.99. Look at how big this thing is. It has 230 dryer sheets. I'm grabbing this one instead and submitting for $9.99 back. And I'm go gonna go ahead and do a little swag bucks or rebate. Uh, I made so much money. Even if I wouldn't have made so much money on the alcohol, this is a great deal on cleaning supplies. I am always looking for ways to save on cleaning supplies. So I'm looking for these Scotch Bright sponges and here they are. They are regularly priced at $2.99. I'm gonna grab three of them and I'm grabbing the holder. It just makes it neater in my stockpile. So these three total me $8.97 and Swagbucks is gonna give me back $6 for buying three. So it's basically like buying one and getting two for free. I will take it. Check your fetch. All rebate apps can differ on the rebates we get. Uh, but we got an awesome offer for 100% back on the Klondike Minis, which my store does not sell. Such a bummer. But if your store sells them, go grab, grab you some free Klondike Minis. All right, it's a different day and my rebate reset. So I'm at Kroger and the, the fun size Twix are on sale for 10 for 10. So they're just a dollar each. I'm gonna go ahead and grab a package of these. I'm gonna submit to Shopkick for 200. No, I wish it was $200 <laughs> for $2.30 back. Makes this free plus a dollar 30 money maker. All right, so this is gonna complete everything I am grabbing over at Kroger. Go check the community tab on my channel. I did post, um, there is an awesome Catalina promotion on some Colgate products. I ended up getting five toothbrushes because of a $9 off five digital coupon for free plus a $4 moneymaker because it's giving back a $5 Catalina. I did not know about this promotion when I did my shopping, so I went later and did it. So, all right, let's head to the kitchen table and go over this rebate haul. All right, we are back at the kitchen table with the rebate haul. Um, I don't know, you can probably see the, like the focus. <laughs> <laughs> the focus of this rebate haul, and I know, I know not all of you will have the alcohol rebates. I'm so sorry. So, of course, as I always do, I will give you totals without the alcohol and totals with the alcohol. This one was kind of a simple one just because I did a few already at the drugstores, which was awesome. And then um, I had just like almost every rebate, I think, except for one that I got at Walmart had double rebates. Like almost all of them had the any offers also attaching, which is so great. So I did go back to Walgreens and did one quick little transaction. Um, my rebates for the Godiva reset and the Purex is probably gone definitely by the time I post this. 
um, but I wanted to go ahead and take advantage of that at Walgreens. So I just grabbed the Purex and the Godiva. Um, I just used, or they're on sale for $1.99. And then all of those ring up the Godiva for $3. I've done this deal, I don't even know, six times now. I used a $4 off a $4 purchase. That's a store coupon for Walgreens. And I printed a $1 coupon from Ask Team Clean. So my subtotal was $5.99. I used $5 in Walgreens cash. You don't care how I paid. This transaction uh, was a cost of $10.99. I earned back a $4 register reward because that's a Catalina promotion for Godiva. And then submitted my receipt for a dollar back on the Purex and $2.25 back, 75 cents for each one of those bars. And these are two separate rebates. So I got three rebates in this transaction, which was awesome. All right, then I went over to um, Walmart and I grabbed, oh, I forgot to pull out the Wii. Hang on, there we go. <laughs> still can't believe that my husband's and I did not have the nerd gummy clusters. Anyways, I grabbed the Wii. I had it in the refrigerator because I did the shopping two days ago by the time you see this. So I grabbed the Wii. I grabbed the Friskies, which had two rebates attaching and any dry cat food and any wet cat food. I grabbed the um, Campfo, which had the one rebate and then an any sleep aid rebate. I grabbed the month of latum. I grabbed the clean and clear, which had its rebate plus an any face wash rebate. And then the suave is glitching with the two rebates. And then I grabbed the Twix because wowzers, like that deal just keeps on getting better. So here was my receipt. I only had the $1.50 coupon off the camp foe and the $1.50 coupon off of the clean and clear. So $15.18. I literally used two coupons and the cashier had to come over and approve for coupons. Last time I used nine coupons and they didn't have to come over. <laughs> so $15.18 for that. Uh, then I went, I'll show you the alcohol last. Then I went to Kroger and I wanted to take advantage of this awesome snuggle rebate. Hopefully you saw this. This just came out in our... Are save, but I know this is regional. So if you did not see this, this was in the insert, letting us know that there is a try me free on Snuggle products. And yeah, I think you can see the the. Um, you can take a screenshot, but I'll try to post the link in the description box as well. Uh, it's up to ten ninety nine. So I wanted to grab the most expensive product I could find. And I didn't, I forgot to grab it when I was at Walmart and I didn't feel like going back to Walmart. So I just grabbed it at uh, Kroger. And that is a huge thing of dryer sheets, 230 for $9.99. So I definitely wanted to grab that. I wanted to grab some more scotch Bright sponges. I had such a huge money maker. I was trying to, there really wasn't a whole lot that I wanted. Um, but we love those sponges. So if I can stock up on those, great. And yes, I grabbed the holder. Just makes it easier to keep in my stockpile. And um, since I did this on a separate day from this, this reset on Shopkick, it was a dollar at Kroger versus 98 cents. Uh, and so I did the Shopkick rebate on the dang Twix again. So here's my receipt for that. I had to circle this to submit it for the snuggle rebate and I want to tell you a little bit of something about that. So 2110 is what I paid here. Um that did give me a little bit of trouble. Every time I tried to take a photo of the picture or a photo of the prot of the receipt, it kept saying that my file was too big. So finally, I ended up I took a picture and I noticed when I took a picture, my camera tells me how big the file is. I clicked on the file size and it did let me adjust. Instead of sending actual, I sent large and that one did attach. So if you have that issue, click on the photo size. It did go through for me then. All right, and then let's talk about the alcohol rebates. Oh my gosh, I already showed you this. They all reset for me. Again, I had eight different Kroger cashback offers on this. Plus, as I told you in the store, these are showing on Ibotta. Although they're not showing under any store, 
So I did send in a request to Ibotta. And what I did was I included a picture of my receipt. I said that this rebate is showing up, but it's not attaching to any store. I did purchase three of the products. Can you help me with this? I sent a picture of my receipt. I sent a picture of the offer on Ibotta. And I sent a picture of all three of these along with the barcode. My friend Steph told me she does this whenever she finds offers that are not attaching to stores. And Ibotta always credits her. So Ibotta is so fantastic. I fully expect that I will get that $9. I will keep you updated. I'll post it on the community tab. Um, I, they're not going to count it as a rebate towards a bonus. That's okay. If I can get my $9 for that, that would be awesome. So eight Kroger cash bags for $70, $9 for my Bata, and I submitted my receipt already to the BYBE app that I told you guys about before. A ton of you shared that with me previously a few months ago. It is a free app. Download it. They have several different alcohol rebates. So if you do purchase alcohol and you are within a state that allows alcohol rebates, because not all of your not all of our states do, this is three dollars back per case, and I think it's up to nine times. So I've already done it three times. This will be three more. I think I can do it three more times on the BYB app. BYBE app. Last time, I think it took two days for them to approve it. Got my $9. I sent it right over to my PayPal. All right, so let's talk final cost. So without the alcohol, my total cost for my receipt from Walgreens, Walmart, and the one Kroger was $47.28. I got back um, a $4 register reward from Walgreens. $3.35 on Ibotta from Walgreens, submitted my receipt to Ibotta from Walmart and got back $9.05, submitted my receipt to, um, oh, I think I forgot to add in. I'll pop it up on the screen. I think I actually, no, maybe I didn't. Um, my shop kick. Um, I earned back my $5 midweek moneymaker bonus and my $5 climb bonus. And then Shopkick was $2.30 back. And then submitted for $9.99 back on the snuggle rebate. Another $2.30 from um, Shopkick. And then submitted to Swagbucks for $6.00. Now, that one I did have to get reviewed, which is weird because last time I did the Scotch Braid, it went through automatically. If by the time I edit this video, they've been coming back super quick when you click, you know, review re or request review, um, I'll pop it up on the screen that I earned it. So it would make my cost for Walmart, Walgreens, and Kroger, minus the alcohol, 28 cents. 28 dang cents for three packages of sponges. I'll take 28 cents. Then I added in the alcohol. A whimsy. So now my cost goes up from 47.27 up to $91.76. Did I already show you? Yeah, I don't know if I did. Here's my alcohol. Um, the only thing I'm going to minus off is the $1.20 off each pack because that's a bottle return that I will get back when I return those. So my alcohol ended up costing me $44.49. So now my cost for everything is at $91.76. I earned back all of the rebates that I already told you about. But now I also get $9 back from BYBE, $70 back from Kroger Cashback, and $9 back from Ibotta on the Bud Light. So now I have earned $134.99 from this haul. That cost me $91.76. He makes it all dang free. Plus a $43.23 money maker. I don't need this alcohol. But this is why I keep buying it. It just made me $40. $40. Oh my goodness. All right. That's what I got for you today for this rebate haul. Again, I would love to hear, did you get a weekend warrior bonus? 
Are you working on finishing up your peak or um, whatever the last one's called? I can't remember what the last one is called. Hopefully I'll get an awesome, well, it doesn't matter. I appreciate every bonus that I get. They're all awesome. Hopefully I'll get a weekend warrior and then I'll complete my peak and my whatever the last one is called. All right, that's what I got for you today. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you so much and I'm gonna see you again soon. Bye.